Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Anthony and today I am going to be bringing you all 15 things that you might not know about food in Minecraft. Now, if you guys do enjoy today's video, then be sure to give this video a like as it will help me out a huge bunch. But anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into this. I hope you all enjoy. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, before beta 1.8, the food actually restored the health a little bit differently. So basically when the player ate food, it would actually restore your health directly. But when beta 1.8 came out, the hunger system was added, which basically meant that you had to eat food to restore your hunger points, which would then regenerate your health system if the hunger meter is over 90%. In the upcoming 1.9 update, enchanted golden apples are no longer craftable, but they can, however, be found in 2.6% of desert temple chests, 3.1% of dungeon chests, and 1.4% of chests in mineshaft. Now, a lot of old school players might know this one as it was probably one of the most annoying things that was in the game a while ago. So basically, before the beta 1.8 update, you were not able to stack food. Can you imagine how annoying that was? You know, basically having a bunch of pork chops in your inventory because you couldn't stack them. Oh my god. The pain was too real. The puffer fish was added in the 1.7 update, but it actually went through a texture change as you can see on screen. So in the early stages of the 1.7 snapshot the texture looked like this and then in the later stages of the snapshot it was changed to the texture that we know and love today. The beetroot and beetroot soup were originally exclusive to pocket edition but are soon being added into the upcoming 1.9 update and you can also use beetroot to breed pigs. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft before beta 1.8 food was extremely difficult to get. This is because the pigs were the only mob back in the day that dropped meat, whereas the cows, the sheep, and the chickens did not drop anything apart from, you know, feathers and leather and stuff like that, and you couldn't really get any meat off them. So pigs were the only mob to really drop meat in the game, and they were also very difficult to find as well. So um, back in the day, before beta 1.8, where all the new food was added, food was very hard to get. A more known fact, but if you happen to find a mushroom cow in the rare mushroom mushroom biome then be sure to right click on it by using a bowl as you will get mushroom stew out of it and it's pretty much fully renewable. Before the 1.4 update all of the food in Minecraft had a dark outline on their texture but it was unfortunately changed because I personally think it looked a lot better as you can see on screen. I don't know let me know in the comment section below did you prefer it when the food had a dark outline on the texture. I personally think it made the food look a lot better but I don't know that's just my opinion I guess. So um, basically before the 1.4 update, the food had a different texture, having a dark outline on it. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft Pocket Edition, there was an exclusive feature where you didn't need any food whatsoever to restore your health. Basically what you could do is sleep in your bed at night time and it would fully regenerate all of your health. The carrot texture was changed from this to this. The texture for the apple was actually taken from Notch's unfinished game, The Legend of the Chambered. Back in the earlier days of Minecraft, zombie pigmen used to drop cooked pork chop, but they now of course drop rotten flesh. That's a shame to be honest because cooked pork chop is awesome. The texture for the cooked steak was originally used for the cooked pork chop. There are three types of food in the game that have a chance of poisoning you. Well, one of them actually has a 100% chance, but uh, chicken has a 30% chance, rotten flesh has an 80% chance, and you guessed it, the puffer fish has a 100% chance. So don't eat the puffer fish. During the survival test of Minecraft, sheep actually dropped mushrooms back in the day and you could actually eat those mushrooms, restoring 3.5 hearts. Pigs also dropped mushrooms in the survival test, but they actually dropped the brown mushrooms and they would come in 0 to 2. But anyways, that just about does it for today's video everybody. I really hope you all enjoyed it and if you all want to play on my Minecraft server, then the IP is play.idactivatemc.net but uh, that's just about it so as always cheers for the fantastic support i'm gonna go now because you know i am hungry after making this video i mean it's 15 things you didn't know about food of course it's gonna make you hungry but um cheers for watching everybody have a really awesome day and i will see you all next time goodbye